Hi, my name is Catherine Tui and I read War Cross by Marie Lu. So I initially chose this book because earlier I read Ready Player One and I was really interested in the book and I found it really um, in fascinating to read. So I just searched around and I tried to find any books that were closely related to or around the same plot and I came across War Cross. So yeah, that's why I started reading. Um, this book is centers around a game called Warcross, and it was created by the famed Hideo Tanaka. And this game is, it took the world by storm. So p everyone around the world is playing the game and it's super accessible to others. One particular girl, um, Amika Chen, she is the protagonist of this book and she happens to be super skilled in hacking. So one day she decides to hack into a Warcross national tournament and something goes wrong. And she gets caught. However, this happens to be this happens to be good for her because Hideo Tanaka sees her talents and her skill and takes her in and recruits her as a spy for the Warcross international tournaments. So this book really follows her journey through learning and training and fighting in the tournament and it's super super action-packed but it also has a little bit of romance like sprinkled around here and there also the plot twist the plot twist at the end is crazy the theme of warcross i would say centers around the corruption of technology uh this is proven because multiple times in the book amika encounters hackers and some of uh, some instances her life gets threatened Additionally, Hideo Tanaka, towards the end of the book, you realize that his intentions for making Warcross aren't what they seem. So this really brings light onto why sometimes, even with the highest level of technology, it definitely has its risks and it definitely has um, its drawbacks. So that it really focuses on that. My favorite in the character in the book would be Amika Chen, the protagonist. And this is because... I just think it's so interesting to read about how she encounters problems since you're reading it through the protagonist's mind and how she thinks of the problems i mean how she sees the world i just thought it was so fascinating to see how she confronts challenges and solves them also i really admire her determination to fulfill her objective no matter what happened so that's why i like her um as for recommendations, if you read Ready Player One, you definitely, definitely like this book. And for rating, I would give it a solid five stars because it blew my mind when I first read it. The plot twist at the end, the building, I mean the character building, the setting, and the story building, they were all so incredibly detailed and so intricately created. And I just found it so fascinating to read and to learn about all about it. So I really, I also really enjoy the, sus the suspense and the action uh, of the book. And I don't know, I just really, really loved reading it. So 